today I'm going to be channeling my and the Belle Delphine and become a gamer girl. And who knows, maybe one day I'll be selling my bathwater to all my friends out there. So I don't own the gaming cat ears, but I do own these cat ears, so I think they'll um, do for now. But I've also done my blush like an e-girl as well, so I think I'm going to look the part. Um, also, the game I'll be playing today is Bloom's Tower Defense 4. Um, this is a huge, huge, huge childhood memory for myself and also for Cole as well. Um, every time he's come over, we've been playing Bloom's Tower Defense. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to start on beginner on easy because... Um, Let's be real, I'm not a gamer girl. I'm, I'm pretty shit by all means. So let's get this started. So I'm gonna start off with a little dart monkey. How cute are these little things? I just gotta get like the perfect pinpoint position. There we go, there we go. Let's go with that. We're gonna use the fast forward button because um, this is gonna take 10 million years, but I have been obsessed with playing Bloons Tower Defense um, as of recently because I just, oh, it just brings back so many good memories. Okay. Let's see how we go with this. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, we got it, we got it. Okay. We're chilling, we're chilling. Let's go, let's go. Okay. This is where it gets boring. It only gets starts getting like interesting on round 10. As you can see, I've unlocked pretty much everything. But um, Bloon Tower Defense 4, you're meant to get the Tack Factory and the Sniper Monkey, but I have not seen it at all once. Never. Never once, never twice. So. We're just gonna deal with what we have here, but um, I think the next thing I'm going to save up for is... Hmm, probably the... The Motor Tower. The Mortar Tower? That's 759 quid, so... We're pretty much there, actually. Let's go. Get this guy and fire it up here. I think the next thing I want to get is increase its accuracy and then get the the, the monkey buccaneer, the big ship. Have a good feeling about it. My aim of this game is to get to round 50 because that means I pass beginner mode. And then my next aim if I do that, if I do that, is get to round 100. I have unlocked everything already, so I've unlocked um, all the full upgrades. I've um, moved up my career rank to, I don't know what my career rank is, here it is. My career rank is sit, um, 67, so this is how we'll do it. Do I have enough? <gasps> so what? I'm so precise. Just wanna make sure it hits the white just perfectly, like there. So I get as much range as possible. Got a boom, got a boom. We got it, we got it, we got it. We're chilling, we're chilling. Look, my strat is not up there, let's be real. Um, we'll see how I go though. Because the one thing I'm worried about are the lead balloons and the camo balloons and the ceramic balloons, because they can't be popped by um, normal darts. So what we need is to have some explosions in there. So that's why I've got the, um, the mortar tower and we've also got the monkey buccaneer for that pretty much exact reason. And yeah, I'm using my gaming laptop, which is a MacBook Pro. That's clearly a joke. I know it's not a gaming laptop. Anyone who says that is a gaming laptop's freaking embarrassing. Maybe I should get a tax shooter. But so many people say they don't like the tax shooter. They just don't, they just don't vibe with the tax shooter. You know what I mean? And I'm the type of person who um, wants to get a perfect 200 lives. I don't want to lose any lives during this whole experience because um, I'm very, just have to be too precise to the point. I'm on 440 monies, 440 quid. We're doing well, we're doing well. I think I will get another, what should I save up for the freaking monkey farm? Oh, does it make decisions? You know what, I'll just get a buccaneer just in case. There we go, close as possible. Just so we can get the range, because once you increase the range, you can target so many more balloons. And also I'll start getting these little uh, monkey apprentices later on in the game, because they summon like these big tornadoes that push back all the balloons. That's super helpful when they come in and like hot and quick, you know? I want to save up for the super monkey and I also want to save up to get a sun god and I'm pretty confident I'll be able to do that if I um if I save up my money well. This isn't a speed run by any means, speed runs. I've watched a lot of Balloon Tower Defense 4 speed runs 
and I just use a lot of tax and I think tax are distasteful. I think using, you know, not tax, I'm um, using the road spikes at the end of every round, really distasteful. I think it's um, not a really good way to go about the game. If you can get zero balloons go through you without using the road spikes, like you're true. You truly, truly done it well. Oh, this one's getting really close. No, we're okay, we're okay. We're chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Okay, I'm thinking either getting another banana farm. Ooh, and then maybe the glue gunner. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I like my strat there. Oh, this one's getting real close and making me real uncomfy right now. But I trust these guys. I trust these um these two boats here. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're chilling, we're chilling, we're okay. We are now going to look at getting a glue gunner for sure. Just to slow down all those pesky balloons. I need to think about my positioning as well. That will do. Then we'll get glue soak. Corrosive glue is what you want, trust me. You want to slow that stuff down and then you want them to pop through all the layers as well and i think i'm going to change the priority of this one to strong so it really really stops those really fast pink balloons hmm thinking i'm thinking i need a lot more attack points you know i need something to really attack them so if you can see down here these balloons here they're going to pop on their own because i use corrosive glue so they really really help with the run i need to evaluate if i need more attack. Maybe I do need a attack shooter. People hate the attack shooter. Screw it. I love the attack shooter. The blades. Oh yeah. That's a big upgrade, guys. Let's see how we go with that. <laughs> this makes me nervy. Oh, this one makes me nervy. Should I upgrade this guy again? The camos. Yeah, longer range is what I was looking for. Okay, 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 okay. I think next I'm gonna save up for the super monkey. Okay, well, we can't do anything now. I've only got a hundred quid, so let's go. I don't want to use road spikes, but if it comes to that point, I think, I think I'm gonna have to use road spikes, which is gonna suck, because I really don't want to use them. Oh, guys, that was a good round. We are actually chilling. We're doing so good. Okay. <laughs> Oof, guys, boys. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, we're chilling. Okay. <laughs> we're doing okay, guys. We're doing okay. Hear me out. We're gonna start actually doing their job. Let's do it. Okay. Should I go here? This one has to be a strong priority for sure. Get through all the layers, guys. Oh boy, oh boy, this is not looking good. Oh no, I think we're chilling. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. I think we're doing okay. <laughs> okay. I think I need another line of attack, but I just don't know what. Another buccaneer? They're doing pretty good, man. Or should I say up for total nautical domination? I don't even know what they do. It doesn't even give a description for it. Eep. I think next round I should be able to get a super monkey. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're, we're doing this. We're doing this. We're trying to get the super monkey. Oh, this super monkey has like little um, Superman clothes on it. So cute. Okay, this round, breeze. Absolute breeze. Okay, we've got enough. Okay. Now where do we want to go with the super monkey? This super monkey has extremely huge range once you upgrade it. I'm gonna go here, but it's not laying in. Oh, that little flash of white. It's what you're looking for, guys. Oh, look at it. Look at it go. Uh, this is a game it makes me so happy. I spend way too much time playing this. It's, it's a little bit embarrassing, but it's so fun. How can you not love this? So fast, I love it. That's super monkey. 
Okay, I think I might wait. Let's see the range of this one. So it goes out here on here. I think my monkey has to go here. Yeah. Start the round and see how we go. Get me some super range. <laughs> That's so fast. I love it. Oh my god. This these super monkeys like OP. They're actually OP. Like they're overpowered for sure. Look, these are all covered in glue as well, which is like perfect. Ah! Spikes, spikes, spikes! Oh god. Yeah, I may have used rose, but I don't know if I actually used it. I have no idea if I actually dropped them down or if I misclicked. I hope I didn't. <laughs> okay, I think what I need to do next is get another plantation. Another banana farm. Right here. <laughs> Oh god! That was a really bad round. That was... That was a really, really bad round. Like, that was probably the worst round I've had. Oh, that was such a bad round! Okay. <laughs> we need a wizard for sure to, to, you know, blow back all the, <laughs> the balloons. That was a bad round, guys. Oi, this guy really pulled through. Look how slow they are. I think I'll get this monkey to, you know, blow back all the, you know what I mean? Like they do the tornado thing and they blow back all the balloons and stuff. So I'll start lining them up here. Let's do one more just to make sure I get all the blowback I need. <laughs> Look how close they are to get buddies. But I'm fast forwarding now and I feel pretty confident that we'll really slow all these down. Positioning is everything, guys. <laughs> okay, this guy needs an upgrade for sure. Or maybe this guy. If I was streaming right now, I could just ask chat, hey guys, what do you guys reckon, hey? What do you reckon I should do? Oh god, I have to reuse my spikes, guys! I hate using red spikes, I think it's unethical. Real bad, I want to put down Super Monkey real soon, man. Put some spikes down because I'm getting a bit nervous. You know, that's that's 50 quid I'm wasting, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Okay, I think I'm ready for another Super. Where do I put you, bad boy? I need something down this corner, don't I? What? Why don't you fit in here? Because you're fat, man. Oh, these these little things are skinnier than these ones, so I can't actually fit the super monkeys in them. What I'll do is I'll put you in here and increase your range. We're killing it, guys! Okay, guys, this is where my dilemma comes in. I don't know if I should upgrade these puppies. Because I do need the money so I can save up to get laser vision and plasma vision. Then I can also save up to get, um, you know, the sun god. So this is why, this is my dilemma, guys. I just, I just don't know. I think I want some more bombs to kind of destroy them down. So I think I'll start lining up some of these little puppies around the corner. The mob maulers, what I'm looking at, guys. These fat ass mob maulers. Mmm, it's what I'm looking for. Guys, we killed that round. We killed that round. We killed that round. Round, round 47. <laughs> this plasma monkey is actually OP, guys. See, the next upgrade for this is like 1,700 quid. That is a lot of quid, man. Okay, I think I'll upgrade. I think I need another super monkey. I want to have my army of super monkeys and then be able to like to upgrade all of them. Let's be real, I'm gonna sell this little dude. We don't need him. We definitely don't need him. Okay, should I get these guys some laser vision? 
let's upgrade that. See how we go. I hope we stand a chance, guys. I really hope we stand a chance right now. Like, I'll be absolutely devastated if we just lose here. We're on round 49. No, we're on level 50 now. We're on round 50. Oh! <laughs> this is just exactly what I wanted. I wanted to get to level 50, pass the beginner's mode. I'm very happy with that. Because some days, I get up to level 39 and just lose it all. Just like um that one round where I lost all my lives. That was a devastating round. I, like, if I let one of those big blimps go through, I'm over. But I'm very happy. This is all I wanted, guys. Thanks for watching. If you want to watch me play some more, then um, let me know.